Hi, this is Ian at Diversified Computers, recording another Mac OS X video tutorial. And today I want to show you how to download and install a program. And in this case, we will download and install Flash Player. Flash Player is a handy tool that allows you to stream video over the internet. And a popular website for doing this is YouTube. So many people, when they bring their new computer home, they try to get on YouTube. They want to learn how to make these glazed grilled bananas with chocolate sauce, of course. It says you have to get Flash Player. So we'll click here. It brings us to the Adobe website, and we want to make sure that we're downloading it from the Adobe website. If something just pops up offering you to download Flash Player out of the blue, it could be a virus. So I would ignore that and download it straight from Adobe, just by clicking the yellow Download Now button. If we look down on our dock at our Downloads folder, the progress bar is zipping right across. But that's only part one. If we go back now and try to play a YouTube video, it still will not work until we actually install the Flash Player. So you have to open our Downloads folder and open the installer. This will put a disk image on our desktop. See the little icon appeared on our desktop and it opened itself up. Install Flash Player. Now it's always good to know where your, your downloads are coming from. This is a download that we requested and we know that it's an okay download. It's not going to hurt our computer. And actually, before I go further, I know that Flash Player wants us to close Safari before we do anything else. That will just save us a step later on. And yes, of course, we've read the license agreement. We always do. Whenever you're downloading a new program, you have to enter your administrative password. Now, we'll keep the unwanted junk from getting inside your computer. You have to authorize every piece coming in. Many people get the first step where they will download the Flash Player they might even download it more than once if you know they download the player and the video still isn't streaming so they click download again but it's that second part where you actually have to install the flash player now let's try to go back to youtube and see if we can watch a video All right, so now we can watch YouTube with ads and everything. So that's it. To download and install a program, you have to download the program. It will go into your downloads folder, but then you also have to run the installer. And once we're done that, we can do a little house cleaning. I no longer need to keep the installer. The program itself will be in my applications folder. So I can get rid of this extra stuff now and now I can stream videos on the internet. Until next time, this is Ian at Diversified Computers.